Towards the end of 2019, clashes erupted between factions of the National Union of Road Transport Workers on Lagos Island, Virga and other parts of Lagos State, leading to the arrest of suspects and temporary shutdown of some motor parks. Lagos State Police Command has been mediating to end some of the issues, but now it intends to put a stop to them altogether. So the fighters now are followers of this group where they're having fight of supremacy. You know, it seems like every other organization is guided by rule of law. There are regulations. And that's why I just decided to call you that if you cannot do your you know anything within the ambience of the law, then the lawyer have to take his course. We cannot fold the arms, uh, allow people coming out to be attacking innocent members of the public. The legal officer of the command right. lays out the terms. If any of the parties fails to comply with this accord, it shall be arranged before a court of competent jurisdiction. The parties are asked to view and understand the document. Some issues were cleared and the papers are signed. That's not all. The state chairman of the union and his vice also signed the witness column. With this latest achievement, all is now set for the police legal team to move to the next level of commitment through legal action. This binding document is expected to guarantee uninterrupted peace amongst the union members.